I mean, we, uh, this is a big day, and we decided <laughs> on the uh, KX65, so we made a phone call to uh, Paul at Freedom Power Sports, and we were about to go pick the bike up, but first, first thing we got to do, though, is wash the truck. What do you got to say about that, Nathan? <laughs> He's like, I don't want to wash the truck. You have to have a clean truck. You vacuum, and I wash the outside. Oh. Baby, what's up, Feeny? You excited that we're gonna get a dirt bike? All right, yay, Feeny! Hey, watch this, guys. Watch how high she jumps. She's like, I'm not jumping nowhere in here. She can catch. Good, Good girl. girl. Anyways, are you excited? How high can you jump? Yeah! Yeah! Get a dirt bike! Yeah! 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 Woo! KX65, give me a five! Yeah! Ah! Phoenix is like, what's going on? I gotta come in. What's going on? Ah, 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 ah. Guys, I just want to show you everybody something on uh, Nathan's neck. I thought it was cool. Anyways, he's got a perfect triangle. Is that a sign, everybody? I wonder. Illuminati. I <laughs> Illuminati. See, look at it, guys. Perfect triangle. My God, that's so cool. Just wanted to show everybody that. I thought it was pretty neat. He's born with that. It's his birthmark. It's my birthmark. Yeah, birthmark. Like you said, Illuminati. I wonder what it means. Wait, how? Then where's my birthmark instead of this? These are all freckles. How can that be a birthmark? But that's what a birthmark is, is a freckle, man. You have it from when you're born. Like, it's not, oh. like, caused by the sun or anything else. Like, you came out of your mom having that on your neck, which is cool. I mean, if y'all think that's cool, just say it's cool or whatever. All right, guys, thanks a lot. We're on our way to get the truck washed, then to the Freedom Power Sports. Where are we going? <laughs> going to that new car wash. It's already backed up, there it is. I just wanted to try this new car wash out, guys. It's brand new, and you know how the new, they have all the new equipment and new um, scrubbers and stuff, so we'll try it, try it out. Let's go to this middle one, I guess, because there's I-75. They've been working on that road for the past two years. Our longest lasting shine. Look at that, look at that. We got the tidal wave, we're cheapos. Oh, cool, do you see that? That was cool. Look at the rainbow! That's neat. Oh, it's doing the rainbow all the way around. Here we go. It does smell good. Oh. The truck is getting scrubbed. What is this? I don't know, man. That's a, like a, a cool looking blue color. There's the rinse. There's the rinse. I bet your car is filled up with water in the back. Oh, in the back. Look at the windshield wipers almost blew off. Oh, they're applying the tire shine now. Oh, this is a buffer, man. This is cool. This is new. I haven't seen this before. That's cool. So it kind of like dries your car up, I guess. It's yellow. Uh oh, green. Let's go. Put it in drive. All right, now let's go vacuum. All right, get all in the cracks, too, man. January 14th. Everybody's getting their car washed. Looking nice. All this thinking about getting a dirt bike is uh, making Nathan hungry. How is it? Racetrack sausage dog. That's good. All right, let's hit the road. Oh, we're back. Look at this, guys. They're like, they're coming. Nathan, lover boy's coming. We got to have a cookout just for them. That was really nice of them, wasn't it? Pretty nice. All right, let's see if we can get some free food. Might, no, we might uh, come back and get some. He just ate. I wish we would have oh, known. I, I would have bought him that starving. instead. You're still starving. This kid oh. eats so much. All right, we're back. Oh, I got. I'm working with Paul. Yeah. Thanks. All right. I think they got it all ready for us. There he is. Look at him. There he is. He's ready for us. 
They have the 110 out. I don't see the. I don't see your bike. Is it still over there, the same spot, or did they move it? They got the 110. Ooh. Hey man, how you doing? Ooh, that thing's bad. Yeah, yeah. Man, that thing will fly right there. That's what we should get, mom. <laughs> So, hey, what's up, Paul? How are you doing? I'm good. That's our salesman. Yeah. Man. There's your bike. Look at it. Woo! That thing's nice. You think you can really ride that? Come on now. We're about to find out, that's for sure. I wish they would have took it or already took it back there and got everything tightened up and fueled up and cranked up and I, had this. I guess they didn't think I was really coming back. <laughs> Here, let me hold that. Let me hold that. How does it feel? What's first gear on it? Show me first gear. One down. And then the rest are all the way up. Five more up, and that's six speed. I want to crank this thing up, man. I can't, I can't like, do it any more than that one. Well, if it, does it, if it doesn't go into the gear you want, you kind of got to rock it a little bit. But when it's uh, running, it's in neutral. Neutral's barely, all the way down, and barely hit it up. Barely, barely. That's neutral. Two, three, four, five. That's it, that's six speed, that's all the way up. Because remember, there's one gear down. One down. Yeah, but neutral is not a gear. Six gears. There's one down, all the way down. Neutral's in between first and second. You understand? So, one? No, that's not one. You're all the way up in six oh. gear. Go all the way down. Three, four, five. 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 And See, that's neutral. You felt so, it? It's in between first and second. So, when you do one all the so way down. Yeah, five up. One all the way down. No, it's six speed. Six gears. But basically, is it like this? It winds out faster. We'll find out. How is it? It's fast. Good. That's what he wants. You want fast, right, Nathan? He's like, how fast does it go? We were lean, you know, KTM. It was between this or the KTM 65 SX. So, What's gonna tune it up. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do to it? Uh, I'm gonna make sure that the oil filter is oiled up on it. Put gas in it. Make sure the carbs right on it. That's about it. Thanks, man. Oh, this uh, chain. Make sure it seemed like it was just a tad loose, but I mean, you're an expert on it. Thing. Here, hop on it. He said, get on it, man. This is where they do all the magic. All right, well, if you say so, I trust you. So that's how the chain needs to be. Yeah. Okay, that's good. You want about a half an inch of play when you're sitting on it. Okay. Back there just said if I'm looking for a bike to ride with him, this would be a good one, a CRF 250 and, uh, no, 230. Feels pretty good anyways. It's like uh, 4,000 4, bucks, but I don't know if I was gonna get a bike, maybe that would be something to start out to ride with Nathan, you know, because I don't want to just watch him. I ride motorcycles too, and it would be kind of fun. But then you got the 450R right there, and that thing's bad. It's like nine grand. Anyways, we'll have to figure it all out. Thanks, guys. Think you can handle that one? Dude. The same pl place where all clutches are. There's your bike, Nate. Go look at it. Go look at it. Come on. He's gonna tell you, he's gonna try it out. What is your boy Leroy looking to buy, do you know? Huh? Leroy, you know how to There it is. Woo! Alright, come on, go follow him, Nathan. Nathan, go. fast you think you can handle that bike I know you can
You see how it's doing a wheelie every time, every gear? You better watch out on it. You ready for it? <laughs> cool. Say, so you weren't even popping the clutch or anything on that, just giving it throttle? That's cool. Yeah. Man, you ready for that, Nate? Cool. Oh, I'll drive it later. Maybe. They're just in the, the uh... <laughs> thing sounds mean. Sounds good. Hey, you got your bike, man. Congratulations. Let's see if you can crank that thing up now. You said that you could crank it up easy. We'll see. Put it in first gear and just drive it over to the truck real slow. Remember, first gear's down. Yeah, down. It's a different pattern than yours. It's different, don't be nervous. Remember, second gear's one up. Put it in first. All right, man, so are you excited? Yeah. So you got the test drive. Oh, yeah. It's kind of cool. Mom bought, bought that for me. Hey, so uh, how did it feel? Cool. When you, uh, when you were driving it? Pretty cool. So we'll test it out a little bit more when we get to the house. We'll eat lunch and then... Put your gloves on and uh, boots and just take it for a little quick spin, okay? Okay. All right, everybody, we got it. The KX65, it's loaded up in the back. There it is. You excited, Nathan? Yeah. He wrote it for a second. I think he uh, he's confused right now about the uh, shifting pattern. You know, he's used to, to the uh, four-speed up, but um, he's he'll get used to that. It's a six-speed. Yeah. One down, five up. But, um, yeah, I rode on it. My knee... My legs are so long, my knee kind of like, when I was turning, kind of threw me off because I couldn't even turn it and then almost throttled it up. And uh, yeah, that thing has some power, man, I'll, yeah. I'll be honest. You mean five down, one up? No, one down, five up. One down is first, then one up, after that is second, third, fourth, fifth, and sixth. I thought it was down. All right, guys, thank you so much for all your advice. Quite we got it, it's in the back, loaded up. We're gonna try to take it and uh, crank it up when we get uh -huh. home. You uh, ride it just real quick without all his gear on, but I said it's okay. You got to wear your, glove, your new gloves and helmet. He's got to undo these straps first, though, so I'll show him how to do that. There. This thing's, a, um, I would say it's about the same weight as the SS, as the SSR 110. No, way heavier. There it is. This looks a lot better, I'll tell you that much. <gasps> Wait! Still have tuner bikes! Oh, we're selling them on the SS. Uh, all right, let's see if you can get this thing down. All right, guys, you got a new pair of gloves, too. So we got it off the truck. It has one of those wires. I can rip it. It's all right. I'll, I'll get the scissors. Dude, you can Just, rip this. That's fine, but get the kickstand. Put it in the kickstand. You still got to get your gloves. All right. He's going to ride in a second. This, See if you can crank it up again. He just wanted me to show you. That's the uh, oil level, oh, it level does have a battery. indicator. That does good. have a battery. Where? Right here. No, that's just the electrical oh. connections. So put the kickstand on, the side stand, go get your helmet, get the gloves ready. We'll be back out here in a second and crank it up and take it for a little spin. See if this boy can ride it. All right. He went to go get his uh, bike. He wanted to ride his SSR 110 real quick and then just to kind of, he said, I'm going to miss this bike. But anyways, he still has it. There it is. Line it up. There's a new one. Put it 
in neutral. Put it in neutral. Uh -oh. All right. All right, let's see your new gloves that you got. What? Let's see your new gloves. This one's definitely bigger. Yeah, it is. Because this one, I can put my feet like, all the way down. Yeah. See? All right, try it on the new one. Helmet, right? Yeah, we gotta pick a helmet out for him. We gotta get a new helmet. Can I start it? Yeah, you gotta take the um, side stand off. Here, let me get it. Turn it around. All right, guys, here he goes. Okay, what's uh, first gear? Um, one down. And then the rest are when you Five go to up. second, go up. Five up. All right. Is oh, the fuel's off. Remember, I turned the fuel off. I think it might be on the other side. It's right here. There's just on and off. Give it a little bit of fuel. Alright, I think he had the fuel lever off because when we loaded it in the truck, it was leaking fuel, so we turned the lever off. So go ahead, see if you can take it up. There it goes. Alright, hey, take it slow, man. You're already, already doing it wrong. Take it slow. 